Welcome back everybody, welcome back. And we're gonna build another engine today. Nope, not this one, but it's gonna look identical to this one. But it's gonna be a much cheaper version. Let's get to building. Should be fun and fast. This, these are usually pretty fast to go anyway. And then we'll compare them. Don't worry, supervisor is here to monitor. Let's go. Here we go, the same as usual. This time I'm gonna lay out all the components, making sure I have every piece that I need. As always, all the tooling is there provided for you. And yes, this engine also spins. And like I said, these models are incredibly easy to put together. I think it took me less than 10 minutes to put this thing together. Everything just snaps into place. This is supposed to be a representation of a Trent 900 engine. It's not an exact replica because Trent family engines are triple spool and this is a dual spool, but it looks pretty and you get the idea. Instructions are well written. This thing costs about $40. And a big thank you to Engine DIY. They've been sending me these engines so I can show it to you and put it together. I think I'm running out of space, but it's okay. I love these things. Thing I did forget to do is on the fan itself, the ring around it, I think that's residue or whatever is left from 3D printing. I need to cut that off, which I'll do later on. Not in this video, but you get the idea. And here you go, your final product. And it spins, beautiful. Here's the other one. Also, a little bit similar, but different. The casing is a bit different. The colors, but yeah, overall the same. Same engine, but uh, this one's the cheaper one. But yeah, there you go. Pretty cool. Thank you, Engine DIY. And I hope you guys enjoy this small little uh, engine build. Later.